So they'll be looking at how to add volume to your last, depending on what you have. Now, we will look at two different kind of slippers, stroke sandals last. I have a pair. I have um, a pair of slippers to last, and these are the kind of slippers or sandals last I have. Now, while this was originally made, built this way for the purpose of slippers and sandals by the manufacturer. You can see it has all the necessary volumes, the shape and all that. This is the size 45, but I want to work on a size 42. And this is the kind of 42 I have. If you look at this last, you will see that originally it was not designed as slippers or sandals last but the vendors turned it to a slippers or sandals last if you look at it it has no volume from the van point to the ink step region to the cone then you go down to the feather edges up to the capital region there is no volume if i use this this way to last this size 42 I will have a problem because this customer has a high ink step and a little bit of wide foot what am I supposed to do while some persons would, would, they would while some persons would use foam or marco to to give volume to the frontal region of the last but I particularly don't do that because sometimes, except for people who are very good with it, you would need to file down the edges and do a few adjustments here and there. And if you are not careful, you will have two pairs, you have a pair of slippers with different fittings. To avoid that, what I do is I give the volume at the back region. If you look at this, this is Marco. This is about two millimeter, while this is one millimeter. Well, I had to give an extra volume to the back region because if you come to the front and you look at from the from 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 the instep to the cone, if you look at the side, there's no volume at all. Here, here is inside. There's no volume. So this will not be able to go in through the customer's feet. So I need that extra volume to be able to accommodate this clip here. So it depends on, 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 on what you're working on, the, the description you're working on. That will determine the, 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 the kind of volume you want to give to your last. But for this particular customer I'm working on his slippers, this volume is right, just right for him. Now, when you have done this, you can see I've tacked it with, a nail, with nails at the back. When you are done with this, you just go ahead, slip it in. And last. When you're done with your last thing and bring it out, you would get the right volume required because this padding at the back would have aided you in the volume required for um, the customer size I'm working on. Now, if you're conservative like me and you, 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 you want to be prudent with your materials, personally, I don't, I don't cut a pair. I just cut one, one leg like this. When I'm done lasting with this, I pull it off and put on the second one because I would use this not just for this particular customer i can reuse them over and over again so you have to know what works for you understand the volume you're working on and you can use this method anytime i hope this helps you thank you